So today is Wednesday, October 2nd, another aerodrome update for you guys. Quick and easy one today, because if you watched last video, you saw that Iran-Israel conflict and what that actually impacted the entire crypto markets, how that actually impacted them. And so today we're kind of on the aftermath of that. But honestly, we're at a nice little consolidation period. We're still up from a couple of weeks ago mid-September so that's honestly nothing to worry about and if you look at it aerodromes at around a dollar eight cents hovering around a dollar seventy cents or a dollar seven cents that would be awesome if it was at a dollar seventy but realistically the entire crypto market as a whole has kind of cooled off from this dip bitcoin specifically obviously that's our key indicator has also cooled off due to this dip and it, it's it's nice to see we're not obviously finding more lows we're kind of just chilling and we're still at places that we were or higher than places that we were just a couple of weeks ago so there's really nothing to worry about and i think in the grand scheme of things this is going to completely blow off once we get to election season things are going to get crazy like i said i predict aerodrome and just the crypto market as a whole to start moving significantly by later this month Whereas I think these couple of first weeks are just going to be more stagnant. And that's why we're seeing this price action. But the point of this video is more so to simply state that Aerodrome is still very, very healthy, guys. This is still a very, very healthy token. If you sold yesterday, then you honestly, I'd say, made a mistake. Because we are chilling at such a nice level right now that it really makes the future seem a lot more optimistic and especially looking at the communities in crypto, if you think about it, we still are expecting the alt season to happen. And what that does is it keeps a lot of people in and expecting huge prices. That's why we don't have significant sell-offs. Like if this was in, let's say summer, and we had a sell-off like this, we could still just see more sell-offs because at that time, short-term wise, we weren't expecting much. We were obviously more bullish towards the end of the year. And so in the summer, obviously that's a far ways away. So people did sell, it made sense then, but right now I think it'd be foolish too, especially if you are very confident in an alt season coming. Just because this happened doesn't mean the whole market is going to crash. This has happened multiple times where there's been conflicts specifically in the Middle East. That seems to be where it always is where our markets tend to recover pretty quickly. And I think that's what's gonna happen. We might even see some pushes into this weekend higher up. But honestly, I think it'd be nice if we just consolidated this week, but obviously pushes are possible. And even then dips are possible, guys. Really depends on what we see happen. And as things progress throughout the week, still very, very early to say, you know, we're on Wednesday today, middle of the week, really don't know what's gonna go on. But obviously, the start of Pumptober hasn't been so great. But like I said in the previous video, if you look at the charts for Bitcoin and just overall markets last cycle, when we'd consider Pumptober to happen, stuff didn't kick off till like around October 15th to the 20th. So we have a couple more weeks if we follow that to expect markets to jump and potentially see a really, really big price for aerodrome again looking to exit spring i'll keep bringing this up and just kind of updating you if anything changes really nothing's changed so far still looking to exit around 25 to 20 to even 30 dollars really depends on what prices aerodromes to hit short term but right now it's looking very healthy and very strong and that is going to be it for today guys just a little four minute update on aerodrome finance and kind of just overall crypto market in general but this will be posted as an aerodrome finance video and with that being said guys i'll see you in the next one